Hello folks, so today's knife, well, for those who know, I don't think these needs, uh, this knife needs too much of an introduction. For those of you who are new, this is a Takamura R2. It is extremely thin. This is a laser. It's an insanely good knife. Very light, good balance point. It feels great in the hand. It comes super sharp out of the box. But it's so thin, it will glide through carrots like I didn't even touch that. But you have to know that it's so thin, so it performs like this, but it's brittle. So remember that. It's still usable. It's a great knife, but it's very delicate. I just, seriously, I can't even hear or feel the carrots. Let's do a little fun thing here. <gasps> oh no, too light knife. No, it's not. See? <laughs> By my own fingertips and we go through. And this guys, it's not like a... Yeah, I can't even break it because it's too small. Ah, nope. We'll take another one, it's too hard. See, we got a good snap out of that one too. Same thing. Oh, come here. Oh, look at that. You, didn't, you don't even notice that the actual carrot is there. It just goes through. It's so amazing. So, for reference, I already have a peeled onion. Like, <laughs> like the famous chef I am, I shall take these up and it's already prepared. Great, right? It is, I'm used to chopping stuff, but the thing is I have to maintain eye contact or decent contact with this because I don't feel where the onion touched the knife. So if I do this, it's hard for me to actually feel where I'm cutting. It, I can hear it, but there is no sensation in my right hand telling me that I'm cutting anything. It's a good performer, it's a laser, it's amazing. Stainless, uh, it has a high powder steel, SG2, and it has a hardness of 62 to 63. It's just amazing. If you haven't tried it, it's highly recommended. It will bring your taco nights to a flying dream. You will just be chopping and forgetting to actually eat dinner because yeah, it's amazing to cut things with this knife. There is no effort in it. It's amazing. Well, Takamura R2. Take care, guys.